The following are the fields you will see when creating or editing a department. First, you have the department name, which is a required field. Next is a department icon that will appear on the order entry screen for the department. Tap Set Icon to review and select your desired image. You may use the arrow buttons at the bottom to scroll through the available icons. You also have a choice between selecting food or retail specific icons. Once your selection is made, tap on OK to go back to the department screen. To assign the department to a course, tap on the course dropdown and select the course you'd like to use. In this case, we're editing our coffee department's course from dessert to beverage. Now let's look at how we can add menu items to the department. In the Items Assigned to Department field, tap on Tap to Edit at the bottom left. Items on the left side of the screen can be moved to the right to have them assigned to the department. Using the Search field at the top will make locating items easier. In this example, we'll search for Espresso, and we'll tap on the item to assign it. If you have multiple items in the department, you can control how the items are sorted by tapping on the Edit button. When you've completed adding items to the department, tap OK, and then tap Save to complete your changes.